since you died. Yes, you're dead right. In my day, men had imagination. With them skirts, they don't need it. <laughs> right, get fell in. Oh, Dad, not a guy. Yes, a gay. Morning parades every morning. Queen's regulations. We've never missed one. We never will while I'm ahead of this household. Right, I'll take chalk. Right, fast. <laughs> Finger. If we had another war, we'd have to surrender. <laughs> Look at your hair. Looks as if we've been slept in. <laughs> and your pajamas, no creases. Well, who cares? No talking in the ranks. No talking in the ranks. Now then. <laughs> Chin up. Chest out. Stomach in. <laughs> I said stomach in. It is in. We did. <laughs> Will it start for you, my girl? Ten days excuse eating. <laughs> By the way, your mother. Where is the old <laughs> lady? Don't you remember after that meal she cooked last night, you stuck her in the glass house? <laughs> glass house? Where's that? You remember. Oh, yes, yes. I remember. Yes. Mother! Come out of here! Somebody might want to wash their hands! <laughs> All right, up! Take top! See! Right, now I'll go upstairs and see if you polish them bed springs. No, I ain't polished them this morning. I'm fed up doing them every day. Now then, my girl, no insubordination. That's not a scotch mist, you know. That's a crown there for the use of. If you don't like the way I run this house, you can go out and get married. That's a laugh. Every time I get a fella ready to ask for me, and you frighten them off with your nutty booby trap. And that flaming assault course in the front garden. <laughs> what are you complaining about? It kept the rent collector away, didn't it? Yeah, Dad. Me latest boyfriend's coming round to speak to this morning now. Go easy with him, will you? The man who marries my daughter will have to prove himself a man. He has. I didn't mean that way. <laughs> not mean that way. <laughs> You'll have to go through the same as it was all the others have. Right, now, if he's coming this morning, I'll go and set the obstacles. <laughs> Here, Mum, you've got to speak to Dad about this military lark. I think me friends are beginning to laugh at us. Laugh at us? Why? What are we doing? Well, take last Sunday. I mean, the way we walk to church. Well, we only had to mark time for ten minutes before the verger of the door. <laughs> yeah, well, Mum, you've just got to speak to him. Now, you know I can't speak to your father. He keeps pulling rank on me. And you know how he likes to respect his rank. Oh, yes, I know. Right. Now, I've set the bucket of flour over the door. <laughs> Next thing to do is to electrify the door knob. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. And I plug the water into the phone, the ice cold water. <laughs> now the trip wire. <laughs> now the chow. The pH to resist off. The chow. <laughs> didn't know I spoke French, did you? <laughs> there we are. <laughs> That's right. There we are. Right. Okay. Yes, I think we're about ready. Now, stand well back. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Who went down? <laughs> How to be recognized? <laughs> You've got my tied up. <laughs> All right, Mr. Higgins, I stand there. Oh, good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Uh, the, the gun uh, went off in the end, sir. I'm, I'm very sorry, sir. Well, you just stand there and take the gentleman's hat. Yes, sir. Well, well I, I expect you've come to see me about my daughter, sir. Yes, I had, actually. I'm still rather embarrassed. Oh, I quite understand, sir. Felicity, go into the kitchen and make yourself something. What? Scale! That's the number. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. No, sir. Uh, Mr. Higgins, your daughter's an awfully fine girl. Oh, yes, sir. Mrs. Higgins. Yes, Mrs. Higgins, yeah. Uh, Stand to attention when you speak your daughter's arm. <laughs> I'm always shouting her praises, aren't I, at all? Yes, he's always shouting. <laughs> well, she, she generates warmth. Obviously takes after her parents. Oh, well, yes, sir. It stands to reason, you know. I mean, our father was a sergeant in the army and her mother was in the 88. She's a sort of army issue. <laughs> 
with you. Yes, uh, like a blanket. Uh, you know. Well, you get the gentleman a seat and I'll go and make some tea. Oh, Charles! Left, right, left, right, left, right. Take it, take it, take it. Take it. Take it. It's a bit dusty, sir. Try that one over there. Thank you. Well, Mr. Higgins, uh, uh, about your daughter. Yes, As you know, I've seen, be, been seeing quite a lot of her lately, and I would like to see a lot more. Well, in that skirt, you won't see much more, sir. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Higgins, I would uh, like to marry your daughter, but I thought I'd ask you first. Really, sir? <laughs> well, that's very nice of you, sir, but uh, I'm already married. <laughs> No, Mr. Higgins, quite simply, I want to marry Felicity, and Felicity wants to marry me. Splendid! Then we'll do it all in one wedding. <laughs> you mean you'll prove me right away? I mean, don't you want to ask me any questions first? Well, I'd, uh, I'd hardly presume to do that, sir. I mean, after all, I can tell you're a gentleman by the cut of your trousers, sir. Oh, well, thank you very much. Not at all. I mean, if I, I'd have known it was you coming round of an evening, I wouldn't have put bromide in the teapot. <laughs> then I can take it with officially engaged. Yes, I, yes, you yes, can. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mrs. Higgins. Yes? Uh, we're engaged. Oh, that's nice for you. <laughs> well, I'll pop it and tell Felicity. Hey, what? the trip was. The trip? Oh, 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 the line here, sir, the line, yes, sir. Rather dangerous? Uh, yes, well, it's, um, it's uh, the washing line, sir. <laughs> a bit low for a washing line, isn't it? Yes, well, the white's a bit of a limbo. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Only small. Oh, yes, well, it's small. <laughs> small. Oh, well, no harm done. Well, yes, sir. Before I embrace my fiancée, I think I'll clean up a bit. Where's yes, the uh, bathroom? Oh, through that door there, sir. The knob! Are you sure you're all right? Yes, it takes more than an electric shock to get me down. Mind you, I should have remembered that doorknob. <laughs> you should have remembered that and all. Yes. Good job I didn't. You can get 28 days over the wall for injuring an officer. Right, now I'll just go and unplug the water from that telephone. Too late, you better answer it. What? The phone. I can't hear anything. It's ringing. Can you hear it? Yes. Will you answer it? I'll tell it before he comes back and does it. It's all right then. <clears throat> Hello? 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 <laughs> <laughs> I, I heard the phone ringing. I left my number in case I was wanted. Mr. Higgins, you're sweating. <laughs> well, your malaria is worse than you think. Yes, I'd better wrap you in a blanket. Where's your bedroom? <laughs> Oh, it's just through the uh, next door of the bathroom, sir. Here, it's for you. Oh. Don't worry, sir. You answer that. I'll get the blanket, sir. Hello, Lawson here. Oh, yes, yes, of course. Yes, I will. Bye. Oh, <laughs> I've just had a nasty accident, sir. But I'm awfully sorry I can't help you. I just had an urgent call. They want me right away. Oh, sir, I'm very sorry, sir. What is it? Army maneuver, sir? Well, no rehearsals. I'm not in the army. I'm at the local rep. We're doing reluctant heroes this week. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, don't forget to look in next week and we'll bake you a cake out of this lot. <laughs>